What's up guys, Rui here from Stretch Health Canada and today we're going to be going over something called voodoo flossing. So you're probably wondering what I'm holding in my hand here. This is just a piece of rubber that's kind of wrapped up and we use this to help restore range of motion and to restore function to restricted areas. You can buy these online, thankfully. Uh, they're only about six bucks. Um, so I'll leave a link in the description below uh, for you to check it out if you want. Now for today, we'll use something simple like golfer's elbow and tennis elbow um, to show the application of this little voodoo floss band. So for those of you who don't know, golfer's elbow and tennis elbow essentially is just a form of inflammation that happens on the extensor side of the forearm or on the flexor side of the forearm. So what you wanna do is essentially wrap this around the area uh, or joint surface that's giving you trouble. Best thing to do is have a friend help you with this, but if you're doing it by yourself, it's a bit finicky. Let me demonstrate. I got it. So I'm going to wrap this thing around the elbow joint using about 50% stretch on the band itself. And you can see I'm trying to kind of layer it over top so that it covers the entire joint. Then when you're done, just take the excess and tuck it under as best you can with one hand. Again, this works a lot better when you have a friend. But we got it. Okay, so my time is limited. You don't want to spend more than a few minutes here because it's not very comfortable. It might even hurt a little bit. As long as we're not feeling any tingling or anything in the fingers, we're okay for now. So you want to start creating some movement in that joint by flexing and extending. You can get the wrist involved here too by waving it up and down. You can even try to create some rotation by putting your palm flat on the ground and then grabbing the elbow or just below the elbow and then kind of creating some torque and wrenching your muscles in a sort of rotary fashion, just like so. I don't know if you guys can see here, but there's a little difference in color. My one hand is starting to look a little pale. That's your cue to stop. Okay, so we're going to unravel this bad boy. Okay. There we go. So you'll feel a rush of blood swoosh back into the area. Feels kind of good. And that might be actually part of the effect. When you do voodoo flossing, you're kind of compressing and kind of driving a lot of those bad toxins away from the area. And then that rush of new blood coming in actually helps bring a lot of nutrients to the area, which is what we need to heal. The other part of that formula is the slide and glide that restores when we create that movement while the area is compressed. It's like having two layers of Velcro that are stuck together that aren't quite moving well. And you're just kind of creating an environment where those layers are sliding and gliding on themselves like normal functioning tissue should. So if we wanted to test this, we could kind of see one wrist might be a little better than the other one. It looks like I might be better here. And you can check your range of motion at the elbow joint, check your pronation and supination. See how it feels. So that was just a quick example of how to use a voodoo floss band. Again, you can pick these up online. Link is in the description below. And this was just one of many different examples and applications. You can use this on all sorts of joints like your shoulder, your knee, your ankle, um, I think even your hip. Anyways, guys, I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. 
And if there's anything specific you want me to cover in a future video, uh, just let me know. Lastly, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel and I will see you on the next video.